Uh, always watch TV. Always watch TV. Fortune teller neutral. Okay, and it's raining, so today would be a good day to go fishing. Oh no. This is the only problem with planting crops early on. You know, you don't get the scarecrow. Crunch Podcast, thank you for the chat. Thank you for the raid also. Very, very kind. I appreciate that a lot. Um, never played this game before. <sighs> My wife and I really, really want the Crunch to do uh, Stardew Valley Co-op Farm because we think it would just be so fun to watch Ethan and Pat. I was chatting in my own chat. It's all right. It's all right. It's like I've got a co-op world with my wife and a couple friends, and uh, we all kind of have our things to do. I'm just kind of the landowner because I started the world. But, uh, you know, it's pretty fun. You can go fishing. I should have brought a chest with me. Because otherwise I'm going to run out of room. Um, ah. Don't miss it. I like to play. Oh, I got to check this. That's right. This is one of my other things I'm doing. Ben, thank you for the chat. And thank you for uh, staying for the raid. Really appreciate you hanging out. I'm looking at the calendar. I need to look at this. Looking for largemouth bass. I think I can do that. Especially on a rainy day. I do want to put some of these things away if I'm going to do that, though. Just just spreading peace and all good as Brother Nathan. Can you only eat fish today because it's Friday? You know, that's, that's another thing I wasn't sure about the rule set. I thought about, should I maybe set a condition where I can only eat, like, vegetarian or vegan, like, foods? Um, but then I guess the, with the fish, I guess you can technically do that. So that would, you could kind of be okay with that. Um, and there's really not a lot of meat options in this game. I don't think there's any actually. So yeah. Can I eat only fish today? Yeah, I suppose. I'm going to try and fish up this largemouth bass here for Elliot. Very much playing Stardew Valley in a way that you don't play Stardew Valley normally. I ever played Stardew. I think my wife uh, would really enjoy it. Uh, you know what? I kind of got my wife hooked on Stardew Valley. You know, I asked her to play it with me one time, and uh, we ended up just playing probably not a healthy amount of it initially because it's really easy to get sucked in, but she really enjoys it, and she still plays on her farm on Switch. Um, yes, perfect. Ooh, some iron. Cool. But, yeah, we did eventually get her Animal Crossing, or I guess I did, as a birthday gift, and she really enjoyed that. That's a game that I think I would want to play at some point. Oh, that was the wrong button. I keep getting the Switch controls and the Xbox controls mixed up. Right? The fact that this whole game being made by one person is just so wild. Every aspect of it. I think that's the part that is so wild to me. Everything from the music to the coding to the design, all that being done by one person is just so cool. And I just... It, it, it's still something I can't fully fathom, I think. Might as well go ahead and uh, drop this off. Do be out here doing the most. Yes, he does. He really does. All just because he wanted to. You know what? I just realized. Am I even going to be able to? He's probably not outside. So, yeah, it's not going to work. Because I can't go visit him yet. I'm going to drop some stuff off at home here. I might have to wait till tomorrow. Let me get rid of some things. I can go ahead and donate this jade I've got. Might as well do that. I guess I could check the saloon and see if Elliot's going to stop by. He probably isn't. I don't really know exactly when he goes places. Let's see here. Drop off some gem. I guess we can put that... 
Maybe over on this table? Why don't I put it on this table? Just for something different. Doesn't seem like you have anything to donate. Better get out and do some treasure hunting. Better go do that. And we'll go do some more fishing. I should probably make sure that I... Oh. And whack. Nice. There he goes. Anyone that anyone that does, knows uh, early game Stardew Valley knows that sometimes fishing is not the most exciting thing in the world. Got another one. Nice. Another silver quality one. Cool. I guess I should also mention what what are some of the goals I have. My main goal with this rule set is completing the community center. Um, driftwood. I want to complete the community center, and secondary goals are to get as many of the star drops as I can, and to get the highest friendship as possible with as many villagers as possible. Max friendship would be awesome. Whether or not that's feasible is hard to say. What am I doing? There's a bubble spot right there. Thanks. You know what? I think I gotta cast that further out. Let's try that. I just realized it was eight twenty p.m. I need to I need to head back home here in a minute. I'll catch this, and then I'll maybe maybe I'll catch this. Uh oh, I'll catch this, and then I'll head back home. That'll do it. Oh, perfect. Can make that uh, make that scarecrow sooner than I thought. Oh, my inventory's full. I can't pick up the nice forageables. Oh, there's like three of them back here. I need to run home and do that real quick. Sell this, sell this. Get rid of these. Get rid of that, get rid of that. I'll put the rest away. And we'll go run and get those forageables before it gets too late. I can't step over this twig on the ground. Help. And a one, a two, a three. And that'll probably do it for day three. Is it supposed to rain tomorrow? I wasn't paying too close attention. Clear and sunny, good. And get some things done. I didn't catch any catfish. Level two fishing, yeah. I can make bait. That's helpful. Cool. All right. Let's see. Tomorrow, clear and sunny, and good humor today. Very nice. Okay. We got a letter. Keep finding cool stuff. My backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's General Store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not doing that. As part of my vow of poverty, I am only, I'm not buying the backpack upgrade. I've got enough inventory space as it is. The grass is encroaching on my crops, and I need to fix that. Maybe I'll make a fence today. Got the jam. Hopefully be able to find Elliot today. I'll take these with me in case I see any villagers. Uh, take this with me. Gotta get rid of this. Cut that too. Probably have to build some fence around that. Uh, it's still pretty early, so I might not uh, be able to find Elliot today. Let's see here. Nothing on the board. Can't help people out today. Let's go ahead and check in the river. 
Yay. We love river soda. Definitely want to take a sip. Green algae. Green algae. Man, it's about the longest amount of time I think it's ever been between casting the line and catching a fish. Another one. All right. Let's see if I can't find Elliot hanging around. That would not be very good if he just decided he wasn't going to come out of his cabin today because, like, I need to... It's locked. So maybe he's not... Oh, maybe it's just locked, locked, because that was different than before. Well, in the very worst case, if I can't deliver it to the person, I mean, not much I can really do about it. You know what I mean? So I guess I'll drop some things off at home. Kill a little time before I try to find... Oh, yes. Get the jam going again. We'll sell the fish. sell that. Oh, I could have given some gifts to some villagers while I was in town. I think it's still pretty early. I didn't see a lot of them around. Trees. Wow. Um, I'm just now looking at my farm, and it's just really, really kind of overgrown. I might have to spend some time clearing some land. This is also one of the few times I've ever played on a forest farm. Uh, I think I definitely want to try some of the other farms out at some point. Because those might be fun. We build a couple fences. Uh, let's just temporarily put the sap there. I think what we'll do is move a little further down. That'll work. Yeah, let's do that. I hate to cut this up, but it's in the way. Oh, let's go over one more. Maybe if it wants to co-op. Thank you. Gosh. We'll start with that. We'll work our way from there. All right, 2 p.m. If he's not out, he's not coming out today. I'll give some gifts to other people. Here we go. It's very nice of you. You're welcome. I could give him a gift this week. Hello. Yes, nope. I'm sure. Oh, no. I didn't realize Jody didn't like those. Oops. Sorry. I was trying to be nice. I mean, I guess that's just sort of a uh, spread in peace and all good can be like that sometimes. Sometimes what you are sharing isn't what someone wants. There he is. Sometimes you have exactly what they need. A large mouth. Ah, oh, the large mouth bass I requested, and it's a beautiful one too. Thank you very much, Brother Nathan. Yeah, I do voices for the characters. Be making some some money. I'm actually gonna buy some crops while I'm here. We'll buy another ten parsnips, and we'll do that. And we'll... that'll work. And. Eh. That's probably a good start. I don't want to grow too much more. That's the catch of, like, those universal-like gifts. Not everybody likes them. You know, Concerned Ape, just that one person. It's like the Prismatic Shards. It's like everyone except Haley loves it. And you give one to Haley, and it's like, oop. Didn't mean to offend. Sorry. And I am hurting for... Energy. I gotta eat some spring onions. Why don't we... I know. I could go give George that of the week. Maybe I'll do that here in a minute. Eating some onions. And we'll go look for more. 
probably won't be ready, but that's okay. Just out here, living in harmony. Peace and all good on Franciscan Farm. Nice. Oh, there we go. Hey. Oh, I need that. Um, let's... Dang. Let's do this for now. I'll come back for it. I don't think there's any more spring onions ready. Nope. Well, I guess what we'll do... Is take all some of this stuff back. And put that there, perfect. Um, I'm trying to see, because I remember giving someone a horseradish, and they enjoyed it. So I want to do that again, because I've got some. Nope. I think it was, well, I haven't even met these people. I haven't met Abigail. I haven't met Pierre. How does it not count? Like, I, I bought stuff from him. I didn't... Okay. Well, I'll do this. Do this. Yeah, we know that one character I haven't met yet likes horseradish, but I don't want to hoard those up until I meet him. I want to store up treasures on Earth, you know? Time for gifting. Maybe if I can catch everybody in time. All right, George. You're welcome. Uh, oh, the museum just closed an hour ago. I can't donate the axe. The good news is tomorrow it gets cool. Because the mines open up. This is going to be talking about this game like it's not over six or seven years old and like the majority of the internet has either not seen or played. Oh, Linus, a leak. Thank you. You here? Yes, you are. You're welcome. All right, go home. Uh, and I think we'll call that a day. Tomorrow is going to be a big one. And we sold some things, which is cool. Sold some fish.